Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim dear brothers and sisters assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Allah the almighty had his own plan from the time he created this world until the end of the world and one of those plans is to make this world to be a better place to live in but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows that this world there will be good people as well as bad people and there will be good times as well as bad times and because of that he sent the messengers to guide us and the final messenger prophet muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam he foretold that there will be many turbulences many problems many calamities many difficulties humanity will see this bad people will do many bad th things against the good people the righteous people will suffer at the hands of those who are evil people and there will be this war between evil and righteousness until near the end of the hour the holy prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wa sallam knew about that jibrail came to inform him from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala about few things which will happen and it is because of this it has been narrated in the hadith that the holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wa sallam says that even if the world will remain only few hours to come to an end allah jalla jalalu la tawwala dhalik allah will prolong those hours or that time or that period until a man from the family of Rasulullah Al-Mahdi will come to fill this world with peace and justice peace and equity after this world will be full of violences turbulences calamities wars destructions out of the rahmah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his mercy the holy prophet says that Allah will prolong it in order for Imam Mahdi to come to fill this world with peace and justice. And it is here we need to thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We shouldn't despair out of the mercy of Allah. One of those mercies is that Imam Mahdi will come to fill the world with peace and justice. Whatever we see now is happening around the world. This will come to an end when Imam of, of our time, Al Mahdi, will reappear. It is as if the Holy Prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam is telling us that we need to have connection with the Imam of our time, Imam Al Mahdi, the one who will bring peace, love, justice, and tranquility in order for us to live in the world full of harmony, full of justice. And it is for this reason we need to remember Imam Mahdi. Maybe there are some people outside there, they don't know Imam Mahdi. These programs are to make people aware, to have connection with the Imam, who is the Imam of our time, who came from the descendant of Rasulullah Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam. And it is this Imam, we need to pray for him. He is praying for us, definitely. But we need to pray for him in order for him to come to fill this world with peace justice tranquility harmony salam there will be no wars when he comes and we pray that inshallah that will happen and those people who are going to be at that moment will enjoy the dua the prediction of the holy prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam we pray to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to mess to make this bond to be stronger inshallah ta'ala wassalamu alaikum ورحمة الله وبركاته